Hi friends! It's so great to see you again! And, if you're new to our Adventure at Home series, my name is Chris, and I'm so excited to go on an adventure today with you! Now, the first thing we do on all of our adventures is we have to check the list! <laughs> the list tells us everything that we're supposed to do, and the order in which we should do it. So, <clears throat> it looks like the first thing on our list is sing the hello song. Would you like to review the hello song so that you can sing it along with me? Hmm, is this thing on? Oh, <laughs> just checking. Now, I said, would you like to review the hello song so that you can sing it along with me? Awesome! I'll meet you in our singing area right over there. See ya! Alright friends, let's review our hello song. It goes, Hello, hello, hello to you. I want to have some fun today. I hope that you do too. Hello, hello, hello to you. I want to have some fun today. I hope that you do too. Great! Just remember to point to yourself and to me and do a little dance at the end and we'll be alright. I think we should try it with music. Okay, are you ready? One, two, one, two, three. Hello, hello, hello to you. I want to have some fun today. I hope that you do too. Hello, hello, hello to you. I want to have some fun today. I hope that you do too. Yay! Wow! Great job with the hello song, friends. It's almost like we sang it yesterday. Now, let's go back to the list. It looks like the next item on our list is to walk. Uh-oh. It looks like we have an urgent message from the commander. I'll meet you back at the control center. Stat! Wow, I wonder what was so important that the commander had to interrupt our warm-up. Let's see. Oh, uh, here's the video. Hello, adventurers. I'm feeling a little sad today because, well, Beatrice, my pet butterfly, got lost on our trip to House Merica over the weekend. Oh, and she's my everything. Do you think that you could go to House Merica and try to find her for me? That's today's mission. I've included a map and a picture of me and Beatrice frolicking about just before she went missing. I would be ever so thankful if you could help. Thanks, adventurers. See you soon. Oh, no. I've never seen Commander Fritz look that sad. What do you think? Do you think we should help him try to find Beatrice? I think so, too. Oh. And it looks like he just sent the map over to my sea slate. Let's check it out. Aw, look at the commander and Beatrice. They look so happy. Uh, well, while we're here, let's check out the map, too. Wow, we have a lot of ground to cover. The forest of Clause, the hall step. Hmm, it would take us forever to get that far on foot. How can we get there quickly? <gasps> Wait, I have an idea. I'll see you in one second. Everyone, meet Maribel. Maribel and I have been on a lot of fun adventures together, and I'm so excited that she finally gets to join us on our adventures. <laughs> so, uh, let's check the sea slate to see if we can remember what our first destination on the map is. Hmm... It looks like we are first headed to the Forest of Clause. The Forest of Clause? Clause. 
Either way, it sounds pretty fancy, huh? Well, let's go ahead and put that address into our GPS. Awesome. And now we can adjust our mirror. Put on our seatbelt. Click. <laughs> and we're ready to go. Now, I know that you might not be in your own car right now, but why don't you just bounce along with me and turn along with me and we'll have a great time, huh? Does that sound like a good idea? Yeah, I think so too. All right, here goes. <laughs> How exciting. Okay, here we go. Turn left. Turn left! You heard him! <laughs> this is so fun! Turn right! Turn right! <laughs> Heading uphill. Oh! Here we are! Going uphill! <laughs> Warning! Warning! Major bumps ahead! Major bumps up ahead? That doesn't sound very good. Oh! That wasn't too bad. Oh. No, that was... That was a little bit worse. Oh, whoa! Oh! No! Whoa! Oh, gosh! Are you okay? Oh, phew. That's great. Well, it looks like we're in some sort of forest. Hey, maybe we made it to the forest of Claus A. Let's go check it out. Uh, uh, oh, oh. There is so much stuff here in the forest of Claus A. Maybe we should try to make ourselves as small as possible so we can fit through. Can you try that with me? Can you try to make yourself as small as possible? Huh? Here we go! Oh, that's so much better! Now, since we're here, we should probably refresh our memory and look at that picture of Beatrice again so we can remember what she looks like. Let's go back to the sea slate. Okay, it looks like Beatrice is a blue butterfly with pink and white wings and a bell. Hmm. Now, how are we going to remember all of those things? You know what? Sometimes when I go to the grocery store, I have a hard time remembering everything that I have to get. So, I make up a little song to help me remember. Do you think we should make up a song to help us remember what Beatrice looks like? <laughs> yeah, I think so too. <clears throat> so let's try. Um... Beatrice is a blue butterfly, a blue butterfly, a blue butterfly. Beatrice is a blue butterfly with pink and white wings and a bell. Uh, I think that'll work. What do you think? <laughs> awesome! Well, let's try to sing that again, together. <clears throat> Beatrice is a blue butterfly, a blue butterfly, a blue butterfly. Beatrice is a blue butterfly with pink and white wings and a bell. <laughs> awesome! So, I think maybe we should try to use that song to help us search for things. So, we know that Beatrice is blue, she has pink and white wings, and she has a bell! Hmm. Do you hear any bells anywhere around here? <sighs> Me neither. I can't hear anything here. The forest is so quiet. Hmm. Let's see. What else is Beatrice? Oh, Beatrice has pink and white wings. Let's look around and see if we can see anything that is pink and white. Hmm. 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 
I don't see anything that is pink and white. Well, what's the last thing that Beatrice is? <gasps> You're so right! Beatrice is a blue butterfly, so we should look for something that's blue! <gasps> I see something blue right there. Now, it looks like it's stuck, so we're going to have to pull it out. But if we make ourselves small, we can fit inside and it should be much easier. Let's try it. <laughs> now, to try to get it unstuck. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> It's really jammed in there. Well, I don't think that that was Beatrice. Hmm. Well, at least all of the clothing in this closet is très fresh and cosy. No? <laughs> Uh, oh, we don't have time for silly jokes. We have to get back to the search for Beatrice. <laughs> well, I guess we know that Beatrice isn't anywhere over here in the forest of Clase. And that's the way we came. And it doesn't look like there's any way out in that direction. So I guess we're going to have to go deeper into the forest. <laughs> All right, let's just... Slide over here so we can see where we're going, and oh my gosh, it actually looks like it's not that far to go, and I think I might see the flapping of wings. Butterflies have wings, don't they? Well, let's try to head in this direction. Beatrice, we're coming! Don't worry! Stay right there! Beatrice! Beatrice! Wait a minute, that's not Beatrice. It's just a bunch of leaves blowing in the wind. Speaking of wind, we're definitely not in the forest anymore. Maybe we should check the map on the sea slate to see where we are. <coughs> okay, so it looks like we were in the forest of Clause, and after that, there's Gusty Landing and the Hall Step. Hmm. <gasps> Oh, well that's it. Clearly we're in the gusty landing, and I don't think that this is a place that Beatrice would have been able to stay for very long. With all of this wind, she must have gotten blown further away. In fact, maybe we should follow the wind and see if we can find her. Beatrice! Beatrice! Whoa! <laughs> Ow! That hurt! Are you okay? Oh, phew. Now, things have been a little bit dangerous so far, but they're about to get a little bit more dangerous. So, make sure that you're not trying to do any of these things by yourself. I am a trained, world-class adventurer, also known as an adult. So, I can do all of these things safely by myself. But if you want to try your very own adventure or climbing your own hall step at home, then you need to make sure that you have a world-class adventurer also known as an adult, to help you out where you are. Sound good? Now, looking up ahead, I think I might see a butterfly in the distance. I can't tell if it's Beatrice or not. And I also see some other very interesting things. But if I leave you there, you won't be able to see any of it. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to bring you along. Let me just put my sea slate aside. <laughs> and I can grab you. <laughs> Get ready for some more adventuring. <sighs> All right, friends, you ready to give this a try? Now I have you in one hand, and I'm going to have to use only my other hand to help us get through this climb, but I think we can do it. I'm going to put you up here first. Ugh. Now, you see this vine? I think I'm going to be able to use this vine to take me all the way. So let me just grab a hold of it. Alright, here we go. 
Oh, wow, this is very intense. There's so much wind coming my way. Oh, and look up above. Look at all the beautiful plants and all of the beautiful like leaves blowing in the wind. Isn't that so cool? <laughs> well, let's keep going. <laughs> you know, I think that we're making one-handed climbing look easy. And as you can see, we're really close to a very bright light up ahead. I can't really see it myself, but hopefully when I make it through this next bit, we'll be able to see everything together. Here we go. Oh no! Are you okay, friends? Wow, the vine just snapped in my hand and brought me all the way back down to the start. Okay, I don't think I can use the vine again, but I think if I attach you to my head and use both of my hands, I might be able to make this happen. Okay, let's give it another try. Attempt number two coming right at you. All right, friends, tell me what you're seeing up there. Okay, leaves. That's interesting. Are you seeing anything that might help us? Know that we're going in the right direction? Lights, you say? Oh, that's interesting. Oh, you saw something blue? <gasps> and something green? Well, we must be headed in the right direction. Let me take you down so that we can keep moving forward. <laughs> Phew! I'm so glad that we made it out of there. And... Wow. <gasps> you were right! There are so many beautiful lights, and it looks like they lead straight to that waterfall right over there. But, uh, I don't remember seeing any waterfall on the map, do you? Huh, let's check again. <laughs> on the sea slate. Exactly what I thought. There's no waterfall here. The map ends with the hall step. Hmm. That doesn't feel right. Maybe we should look at the photo of Beatrice and Commander Fritz again. <gasps> Aha! If you look at the background of this photograph, you can see that there is a waterfall, which means that the Commander must have seen Beatrice right around here. <gasps> Amazing! That means that all we have to do is head towards that waterfall, and surely Beatrice will be somewhere nearby! <laughs> How exciting! <gasps> Are you ready? Let's go! Whoa! Look at this beautiful waterfall! I can't believe that we've made it this far! Pat yourself on the back for great adventuring! Now, this is the location of the photo of Beatrice and Commander Fritz. So let's look around and see... Did you hear that? I don't know what that sound was. It was almost like... <gasps> it sounded like a bell! And it's coming from behind the waterfall! I think that we might find Beatrice back there! <sighs> but it's so small, I don't think I could fit through. <gasps> but I think that you can! Come on, it'll be so easy! And you haven't let me down thus far. Come on, friends. I'm gonna put you through the waterfall, and I want you to tell me exactly what you see. Okay, friends. What do you see? Do you see anything on the other side of this waterfall? A butterfly? Well, what color is it? Blue? That could be Beatrice. Wait, did you say that you see another butterfly? And another butterfly? Wow, how many butterflies do you see? Oh, that's amazing! Uh-oh, but if there are this many butterflies, how will we know which one is Beatrice? And how will we be able to get her out? Hmm... I'm gonna have to think hard about this one, but why don't I bring you back through and we can try to figure out how we can lure Beatrice out from behind the waterfall.
Wow, thank you so much for being my eyes and ears inside of the waterfall. Now, while you were in there, I remembered that I had saved a piece of Beatrice's favorite chocolate candy. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick this candy through the waterfall and hopefully Beatrice will land on my fingers and we can take her home. All right, here it goes. <clears throat> All right. Now we have to wait for her to land, and while we're waiting, I think we should refresh our memory on our Beatrice song. Because if we use that song, we can remember what she looks like and make sure that we have the right butterfly. <laughs> Alright, are you ready? Beatrice is a blue butterfly, a blue butterfly, a blue butterfly. Beatrice is a blue butterfly with pink and white wings and a bell. One more time! Beatrice is a blue butterfly, a blue butterfly, a blue butterfly. Beatrice is a blue butterfly with pink and white wings and a bell. <gasps> I think someone just landed on my fingers. Let's see who it is. On three. One. Two. Three. Oh my gosh, what a beautiful butterfly! Now, Beatrice has a bell. <laughs> Does this butterfly have a bell? You're right, she does! Now, <clears throat> Beatrice has pink and white wings. Does this butterfly have pink and white wings? Wings? <gasps> she sure does! And now, last question! Beatrice is a blue butterfly. Is this butterfly blue? Absolutely! I think that we found Beatrice! Yay! <laughs> Great work, friends! Now, I'm gonna do my best to get Beatrice back home safely to the commander, and why don't you meet me back at the control center, okay? Woo! Yay! <laughs> thanks so much, brave adventurers, for helping me on today's journey. The commander sends his thanks, and he's so excited to have Beatrice back at home. Now, I know I had a great time, and I hope that you had a great time, too. And speaking of times, I think it's Time for us to check the list and see what's next. Hmm. It looks like the last thing on our list is for us to sing the goodbye song. All right, friends, you know what that means. I'll meet you over there. All right, friends, it's time to say goodbye. Here we go. One, two, one, two, three. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Thanks so much for playing along with me today, friends. If you liked what you saw today, go ahead and click subscribe so that you get a notification every time that we post a video. And if you love the work that Arts on the Horizon is doing and you want to give them a little bit of support, go ahead and click the link at the end of this video or down in the description box. Until next time, friends, it's been such a great time having adventures with you, and I hope that you continue to have your own adventures using the power of imagination in your very own homes. Bye! Bye!